Good evening. This is Luke Thomas, home coach of the Earthquake Forecast Center, QuakePrediction.com. 7.45 in the evening on Tuesday, December 20th, 2022. 7.45 in the evening on Tuesday, December 20th, 2022. And we got some things to go over in, uh, and review, including the 6.4 earthquake that hit in Northwest California. All right. First of all, um, we've been forecasting a strong earthquake in the west central part of California on the 21st to the 22nd. And this quake here, the 6.4 hit in Northwest California early in the morning, about two o'clock in the morning, 2.30 in the morning about um, California time in Northwest California, 6.4 earthquake. And that was felt across uh, a huge area of California. And let's see here. This was the forecast map for the 20th. You can see the quake hit right here near Eureka. And we had mentioned that in our last video, that that is where the risk is. And then the risk expands into San Francisco, down into uh, uh, Santa Maria, Parkfield, Santa Barbara, that area on the 21st. So uh, this is the greatest concern even now is for the 21st into the 22nd. And this, the reason why this quake occurred up here on this 80% risk, 6.4, is because, and right now let's see, there's been 56 earthquakes up in this area in Northwest California. See all those quakes that have hit in Northwest California. And the reason why that occurred up there instead of in the west central portion of California from San Francisco Bay down to Santa Barbara, west central California, is because there's such a huge area of, uh, of uh, risk here and the, um, the electromagnetic field is tangled up and blocked in this area so much that it, it's kind of spilled over into Northwest California. So that being said, we're still looking for a strong earthquake in the San Francisco Bay to Santa Barbara, Santa Maria, Parkfield, that area, most likely in the San Francisco Bay. And I'll show you that in a second here. See this uh, forecast model here says the San Francisco Bay itself on the 21st and the 22nd. This model says San Francisco Bay down to Santa Barbara, including West Central California. So both of these forecasts include the San Francisco Bay, and this one includes the area all the way to Santa Barbara. So the most likely place for this 6.5 earthquake, we've upped the ante to 6.5 because the, uh, the energy spilling over to Northwest California produces 6.4. So there's even more energy down in here, blocked energy in the San Francisco Bay to uh, Northwest of LA. And uh, this forecast model says San Francisco Bay. And this one says from San Francisco Bay to Northwest of LA. So both of them say the San Francisco Bay. So that's the most likely spot for the earthquake to occur during the next 48 hours, most likely on the 21st in the evening into the 22nd in the morning, but it can occur anytime during the next 48 hours. Again, that forecast here uh, says San Francisco Bay, and this one says San Francisco Bay to Santa Barbara. Somewhere in that area, looking for a strong 6.5 earthquake or larger uh, during the next 48 hours. Then the risk uh, is centered Northwest of Los Angeles and from Eureka all the way down to uh, Reno, Nevada, and into Nevada itself on the 22nd. This is the highest risk right here, uh, northwest of LA on the 22nd. And then the 23rd, the risk begins to diminish across the whole area. And on the 24th, the risk is, I mean, we could still see a lot of uh, aftershocks during this period on the 24th. And then the 25th, uh, risk here in the far south portion of California down near the Salton Sea in San Diego on the 25th. So once again, looking for a strong earthquake in the San Francisco Bay to Santa Barbara area, most likely in the San Francisco Bay, a 6.5 earthquake or larger is likely during the next 48 hours, most likely on the 21st 
into the 22nd, late on the 21st into the 22nd in the morning. All right, in Alaska, very high risk down here in the Aleutian Islands, uh, Sand Point and Dutch Harbor down this area west and southwest of Kodiak Island down here on the 23rd into the 24th. Italy, now there's many different forecasts, uh, daily forecast over at quakeprediction.com. You can see those details um, if you look at quakeprediction.com. But this one here is for the 25th and 26th when an area of 90% risk uh, in, in kind of a south central Italy, central Italy is right here, kind of in the southern portion of Italy there. I believe that's close to Naples, 90% there. And then down in Sicily, uh, western Sicily as well, 90% on the 25th and 26th. Japan, the risk is way in the far north uh, during the next few days. New Zealand, we could get a strong earthquake. Uh, 5.0 to 6.0 earthquake is possible down in southern New Zealand. And that area, if you look at the map here, is from Ashburton, Tim Timaru, I guess it is, and then over to the west coast. So you can see that area. Here's Christchurch right in this peninsula here. So the Christchurch is right in this area here. I mean, it could happen in Christchurch, but most likely southwest of there near Ashburton and this area here, just southwest of Christchurch. This area could get a 5.0 to 6.0 on the 25th and 26th. Taiwan is pretty quiet. Once again, we are looking for a strong earthquake yet. We got the 6.4 earthquake in Northwest California. And that might be it. That might be the quake that we were waiting for. However, I still don't, I still think that uh, we're going to get a more significant earthquake down in this area. And the reason is this area from San Francisco Bay down to Santa Barbara is a much more tangled magnetic sphere is more tangled up and bound up in that area than it is in Northwest California. So that energy was just spilling over into Northwest California. And I think the greatest risk is still from San Francisco Bay down to Santa Barbara, focused on the area near Parkfield. But this forecast here says San, uh, San Francisco Bay. So uh, that's the most likely spot for this quake to occur. Thanks again for your support here at quakeprediction.com. Uh, going on 18 years of research here at the Earthquake Forecast Center, quakeprediction.com. 18 years of research and about a quarter million followers, 250,000 followers on YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter from around the world. Thank you so much for your support. And again, stay safe in the area from San Francisco Bay down to northwest of LA during the next 48 hours. Looking for a strong earthquake in that area. Please warn your friends and family. I don't believe it's over yet. Uh, the, uh, the, the larger of the two earthquakes, I believe, is going to happen. The 6.4 earthquake hit in Northwest California, but we're still waiting, I believe, on a more significant quake in the San Francisco Bay or the area in West Central California. Thanks again. And uh, if you have any questions or comments, please, please leave those in the comment se section uh, just below this video. And please be sure to subscribe. Appreciate that. And um, thanks again for your support. And we'll be back uh, again after this earthquake hits in the San Francisco Bay or West Central California or Northwest of LA during, uh, during the next couple of days. We should be back with another video. So thank you so much again. And God bless you. And Merry Christmas coming up. Happy New Year coming up. But uh, this quake should hit uh, before that time. Thank you so much. We'll talk to you soon.